This week's top five begins with Heidenheim's Ben Halloran and a perfect finish to cap off the perfect solo run. Mark Schnatterer covers almost the full length of the pitch and with red shirts waiting in the middle, he brilliantly picks out Halloran who volleys home to open the scoring and rounds off a great move in Heidenheim's 2-0 victory over Kreuzer Furt. At four, it's our second counter-attacking goal. Neshmedin Darkfus earns Würzburg all three points against Armenia Bielefeld with this brilliant curling effort. With the full-time whistle just eight minutes away, the German-Tunisian Cooley cuts inside before rounding off a fine breakaway with his left boot, netting his first goal of the season and securing an away win for high-flying kickers. At three, it's Guido Buchstaller at the double. The Nuremberg man pulls out the back heel to grab his second goal of the game against Karlsruhe. Despite protests, the offside flag rightly stays down as the forward cheekily flicks home FCN's second goal in a 3-0 win. Our silver medal goes to Bundesliga 2's table toppers. Nick Omladic's wonder-free kick ultimately proved the difference in Braunschweig's meeting with Kaiserslautern. A pinpoint strike curling beautifully into the bottom corner leaves the Red Devils keeper stranded. It was the opening goal after only 18 minutes, but turned out to be enough to earn another win for Eintracht. And top of the charts is Eskerberg Auer's Pascal Kupka. The son of Germany goalkeeping coach Andreas earns his spot at number one with this party piece against St. Pauli. It was the equaliser in a tight match, one that Auer ended up winning 2-1, not least thanks to Kupka's fifth goal of the season. And this delightful back heel isn't just his best so far, it's also our number one goal. The flicks, the tricks. The flair, the swagger. Loves over the effort. The first goal of the Bundesliga season is an absolute crack. Pick me. Pick me. Take part now. Now.